and welcome to another Yoga Flow. If you are new here, thank you so much for tuning in. I am Charlie. It's lovely to be your teacher and your guide. This is the first class that is part of the Blissful Body series. And to me, yoga really just means embodying bliss. It always leaves my body feeling like just oh, lovely. And I want to help you feel that yourself. So this series is focusing on the entire body. And the first class, this class, is going to be focusing on the legs. So when you're ready, let's flow. Okay, start at the top of your mat. Separate your feet hips width. Take a deep breath in and lift your chest. Exhale and fold forwards. And as it's the start of the class, find bends in the knees so the legs and the knee joints are a little bit softer. Let your entire torso hang heavy. And just ease into the pose. Take a few moments as you hang out here to tune into your breath. Begin to become aware of your inhale and your exhale. And with each exhale, allow yourself to relax a little bit more. And you may even begin to feel your body slowly, a little bit more spacious with each exhale. Inhale, lift up halfway. Lengthen your spine, roll the shoulders down the back. Exhale, lower the hands and step the right foot back, lower the knee. Arms up, low lunge. Use the strength in your legs here. So you're pressing through your front foot and your back shin. Inhale deeply, lift up through the torso. Exhale out, lower the hands to the mat. Extend your front leg forwards and flex the foot. Squeeze your inner thighs together for stability. And take a deep breath in, lift your heart, shining your heart forwards. Slow and steady breaths here as we begin to bring some sensation into the back of the left leg. Bend your front knee. Tuck your back toe, lift your back knee and reach the arms up for high lunge. Take a moment to steady yourself here so you feel strong through the lower body. Take a deep breath in, lift the ribs as you create space for the breath. Exhale out, plant the hands and step back for plank pose. Take a breath in, plank. And as you exhale, come down through Chaturanga or modify, find your way to the belly. Inhale, come up to find Sphinx. Roll the shoulders down the back and shine your heart forwards. Take a deep breath in here. Breathing life into your heart space. As you exhale, lower the chest and press back for downward facing dog. Set the hands and the feet and find any movements you need to create a little bit more space in your body.
Step the right foot forwards, lower the back knee. Reach the arms up for low lunge. Press the front foot into the mat and your back shin. Inhale deeply, lengthen your torso. Exhale to empty out, lower the hands. Extend your front leg forwards and flex the foot. Keep your torso long, shining your heart forwards. And deepen your breath. Bend your front knee, tuck the back toes, lift the knee, arms up, high lunge, steady yourself, root down through both feet, inhale deeply, exhale and plant the hands, step back for plank, take a breath in position, exhale to move through chaturanga, Inhale to find Cobra or Sphinx. Roll the shoulders back. Deep breath in. Exhale out. Find Downward Facing Dog. Set the hands and the feet and take any movements you need to settle in. Lift the left leg and open out the hip. Take a deep breath in. Exhale, step the left foot in between the hands. Turn out your back foot. Bring the left hand to the inside left leg and reach your right arm up. Open out your torso. Deep breath in. Exhale, relax your head to the left. Inhale deeply. Exhale out. Lower the right hand. And then walk both your hands to the middle of the mat, to the side, keeping the legs as they are and folding forwards here. So it's like a warrior two straddle fold combination. Relax your head and neck completely. Press down through both feet so the legs are still working here. Deep breath in. Exhale out. Wonderful. Inhale, lift your torso. Bring the hands to the front of the mat. Turn the back toes forwards, lower the back knee. Edge the back knee further down the mat and then reach the arms up, low lunge. Tuck your tailbone and draw your low belly in. And if it feels available, interlace your fingers, point indexes to the ceiling and begin to arch your spine so you come into a heart opener. Bring your awareness back to your breath and settle into this state of bliss. This inner peace that we're cultivating. Release the arms and neutralize the spine. Bring both hands to the inside left leg and edge your left foot to the left side. Option to stay up on the hands or you can lower down to the forearms for lizard pose. Relax your head and neck. Soften the space around the left hip.
Inhale, lift the torso. Bring the hands under the shoulders. Tuck the back toe, lift the back knee and turn out the back foot. Begin to sink your weight towards your left heel. So you're lunging to the side. And then spin the right foot so the toes face the ceiling. And the foot is flexed. If the balance is there, bring hands into prayer for Skandasana. Press down through both feet. So you're using your strength to hold yourself here. Inhale deeply. Exhale all the air out. Lower the hands for stability. Lower the back foot, turn the toes forwards and step back to plank. Moving through your vinyasa. Exhale to come down. Inhale to find your back bend. And exhale to find downward facing dog. Settle into the hands and the feet. Lift your right leg, open out the hip. Inhale deeply. Exhale, step the right foot in between the hands, turn out the back foot. Bring the right hand to the inside right leg and reach the left arm up. Open your torso as you reach up. Relax your head to the right. And steady your breath. Lower the left hand. Walk the hands to the middle side of your mat and fold forward, settle into your warrior two straddle fold combination. Inhale, lift the torso, walk the hands forwards, turn the back toes to face the front and lower the back knee. Edge the back knee further down the mat, so we begin to open up the hip and reach the arms up for low lunge. Interlacing the fingers, pointing indexes to the ceiling. And if it's available, begin to arch your spine. Keep the tailbone tucked. Draw your low belly in. Steady your breath and find your bliss. Inhale deeply, come back through neutral spine and release the hands down to the mat. Bring both hands to the inside right leg and edge the right foot to the right side of the mat. Settle into lizard pose. Stay up on the hands or come down to the forearms. Relax into the posture. Come back up onto your hands if you're down on your forearms. Tuck the back toes, lift the back knee and open out the back foot. Begin to take your weight down towards the right heel 
and flip the left foot so toes face the ceiling. If the balance is there, bring hands away from the mat. Press down through the left heel and the right foot. Inhale deeply, lengthen your torso. Exhale, empty out. Lower the hands to the mat. Lower the back foot, turn the toes forwards and step back for plank pose. Lift the hips straight away, find downward facing dog. Settle into position, take any movement you need just to reset. Lift the left leg, keep the hips square. Bend the knee and step the foot forwards in between your hands. Stay up on the ball of the back foot and extend the front leg. Keep the chest lifted parallel with the ground. Take a deep breath in. Exhale out. One more breath here. Exhale out, oh, lovely. Step back, downward facing dog. Lift the right leg, keep the hips square. Bend the knee, step the foot in between the hands. Stay up on the ball of the back foot and extend your front leg. Keep the torso lifted and steady your breath. Step back for downward facing dog. Lift the left leg, keep the hip square. Step the left foot forwards, bend the knee. Step the back foot a foot closer and ground down through the back heel, extend the left leg. Press down through both feet. Take a breath in and lengthen your torso. Exhale and fold forwards over the front leg. The hands can stay on the ground or if the balance is there, bring your arms around your front leg and give your front leg a little bit of a hug. Settle into the pose. Steady your breath. Bring the hands back to the mat, lift your torso and step back to downward facing dog. Set the hands and the feet. Lift the right leg, keep the hips square. Step the foot forwards. Step the back foot a foot closer and ground down through the back heel as you extend the front leg. Inhale and lengthen the torso. Exhale and fold forwards over the front leg. And again, if the balance is there, bring the arms around the front leg. And settle in. Bring the hands back to the mat. Step back to downward facing dog. 
Set your hands and your feet. Then step both feet towards the hands. Find forward fold. Let the torso hang heavy. You can bring the hands to the ground, to the backs of the heels, maybe even hugging the backs of your legs. Inhale, come up halfway. Exhale, fold. Step back for plank. Lower your knees to the mat and sit the hips down to the heels. Swing the legs all the way forwards. <laughs> Bend your right knee and hug the knee into the chest. And let the knee fall out to the right. Bring the foot to the inside left leg. Take a breath in, lengthen your torso. As you exhale, fold forwards towards the left leg. Come out of the fold, bring the right knee in and extend the leg down the mat. Hug your left knee in, let the knee fall out to the side, bring the foot to the inside right thigh. Take a deep breath in and exhale to fold. Come out of the fold. Bring the left knee in, extend the leg down the mat, and lower yourself down to the back. Hug both knees in, and then draw the knees from side to side, finding a gentle rock to massage your spine. Maybe even snaking the hips from side to side to get a little bit more creative here. Keep the knees bent, but lower the feet to the mat. Release your arms to your side. Knock the knees from side to side. Just finding gentle twists. Begin to slow down your movement. Start to slow down your breath. Bring the knees back through center and extend them down the mat. Extend the legs. Relax your entire body and soften into stillness for Shavasana.
to deepen your breath and observe the body resting. Observe your state of inner bliss. And remember this feeling as you start to find small movements in the fingers and toes. Hug the knees into the chest. And roll over onto one side. Take a moment here to collect yourself and find your way back to a comfortable seat with the eyes remaining closed. Settle back into your environment. And savor this moment. Savor this feeling and allow this sense of bliss to fill you up, and to ripple out into all areas of your life. When you're ready, open your eyes. Thank you so much for joining me for this class. If you enjoyed it, please leave a comment. I would love to hear about your experiences. Namaste.